Rithik Mondal is joining us live from Arpita's residence in Kolkata and Priyanka Tibrival, the Bharati Janta Party leader, is uh, joining us too. Uh, Mr. Tibrival, over to you first. Uh, I just, you know, it's baffling when you have cash worth 20 crore rupees, gold bars which are found in Arpita's house. Uh, what more proof does anybody require in terms of there being something very fishy that is going on as far as this is concerned? It clearly looks like a scam and the TMC it, it needs to break their silence on this. I think they are left with no face to break their silence because when huge sums of money is being earned like this and you know not just that multiple documents of properties which have been found and when you try to investigate in the same the ED will come to a conclusion where these properties are not shown in their ITR return. So it is as clear as crystal because if you do not show those incomes in your ITR then where has those properties come from and if you are owing those properties and you have evaded tax, then you should be booked under the income tax as well. And you have to show the valid source of income, which is not there because we all know that this amount of money which has been unearthed, this is not a white amount which they have earned. This is definitely a black money and they have to answer for that. Now, see, it is always there that those who are at the receiving end of the ED, you know, uh, due to uh, the action which is powered by the uh, PMLA Act, they cry foul. They say that, you know, it's about to come to that. That's the point I was about to bring up what you have just spoken about because the TMC always is uh, accusing the Bharatiya Janta Party of mm -hmm. using central agencies including the enforcement directorate to target their own netas. But on the other side, when you have 20 crores, I mean, who keeps 20 crores of cash in their house? Not just 20. The last night before I went to bed, almost I think they were running short of machines to count the cash because the figure has crossed 40 crores that figure had crossed uh, and this was you know uh, till midnight yesterday so uh, again i will say that those who are at the receiving end you know they question that the uh, process which emerges out of the law because the law is very clear it, it it tries to stop any kind of misuse it tries to stop any kind of corruption so then they say that you know this uh, agencies are uh, being used uh, by the a party in power, they question the legality and uh, you know uh, this is also so very clear that only yesterday a three judges bench has given a judgment in the Supreme Court when the court has dismissed a plea which was filed by a number of ministers of the opposition like P. Chidambran and Anil Deshmukh and the uh, uh, court gave them a reality check by dismissing the plea. See there were uh, certain uh, 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 principles on which the court has passed their judgment yesterday where they have said that there is no arbitrariness. There is no arbitrariness in the provision of the act as it is empowered uh, by the ED to conduct searches and raids. Yes, that's, that's that true. Is, uh, what the, that is what the act says. So you have the rights to conduct the searches and raids and see. Uh, that is the latest Supreme Court. Means. Yes, yes, that is what the Supreme Court has observed and that's been a latest development. We've been running that story as well. Uh, Ms. Tibribal, I request you to hold on with us. Rithik Mondal is also with us. Rithik, now, you know, the TMC clearly has distanced itself from Partha Chatterjee. But the fact of the matter is Partha is somebody who has been a close aide of Mamata Banerjee. Why is it that today TMC does not want to break its silence or even issue a clarification in this regard? Right. Uh, at, at, at this point in time, when uh, opposition is targeting Trimul Congress and saying this is just nothing, uh, at the tip off of an iceberg, and uh, we're given to understand that uh, TMC is trying to maintain distance from Partha Chatterjee uh, and Mamata Banerjee gone on record the saying that uh, uh, even, uh, even uh, Chatterjee uh, proven guilty, party will take action against him. But remember, Partha Chatterjee, a key, uh, you know, close associate and of course a very, very you know, crucial and very significant uh, member of uh, Mamta cabinet and uh, he b b b he always maintained a very close relation with uh, uh, you know but, uh, Mamta Banerjee also so which is why opposition is uh, targeting uh, Trinamool Congress why uh, why they are not uh, taking any action against Partha Jadri but as as of now we spoke uh, uh, with the Kunal Ghosh yesterday even and uh, he said that they are uh, they are just waiting and watching what else is happening but they have uh, uh, they are keeping their faith uh, you know on uh, uh, investigation but uh, uh, you know questions remains at this point in time but let me show you what we are bringing uh, uh, what we are picking up at this point in time that we we are being told that at least eight, 28 crore 
of uh, cash has been recovered from Arpita's uh, flat, which is located in Belgoria. We are uh, bringing this live broadcast from this particular flat. But uh, let me ask some of the, the neighbors of Arpita Mukherjee. Aap se, Madam, jaane ki koshish karenge ki aap bilkul bagal wale ghar mein rehte the. Kal raat tak, der raat tak, kari dus ghanto tak yahan par ye counting chali. Uske baavajud itna paisa mila. Kya kabi aapne Arpita ko dekhi the? नहीं मैंने कभी नहीं देखा अर्पिता को मैं अर्पिता को पहचानती भी नहीं हूँ मैंने टीवी पे ही पहली बार उसका उसका फेस देखा कौन रहता था इस फ्लैट में कैसे बता सकती हूँ अभी पता चला कि अर्पिता का फ्लैट है ज्यादातर बंद रहता था हाँ बन रहते हैं मेरे दोनों फ्लैट बन रहते हैं मैं अकेली रहती हूँ अच्छा तो अगर ये सवाल जरूर आता है कि जितने पैसे वहाँ से मिले उनको ले जाने में एक ट्रक बुलाना पड़ा तो बारी बारी में शायद इसको लाया गया था तो आ, कभी किसी को कोई भनक आपको मिला कि कोई लोग आज संदिग्ध लोग आ जा रहे हैं ऐसा कुछ नहीं हमको कभी नहीं लगा क्योंकि हम लोग तो बंद रह, अकेले रहते थे तो हमेशा लॉक करके रहते थे सो क्वेश्चन राइज दैट हाउ कम दैट कुड बी पॉसिबल द सच अमाउंट ऑफ मनी अमाउंट ऑफ कैश has been recovered from inside this particular flat and not we are given to understand that cash was uh, kept inside the bedroom and uh, cash uh, cash was recovered a huge amount of cash also was recovered from the you know uh, from the ca from a ca cabinet uh, just uh, inside the wash basin of the bathroom but uh, with the, let me show you one thing that uh, Enforcement Directorate officials, they have recovered the CCTV uh, footage and the you know, uh, files have been recovered by Enforcement Directorate. That could lead to uh, give a pulse or a sense uh, uh, who are coming uh, in, this, uh, in this residence. But we are given to understand that uh, uh, you know, Arpita Mukherjee, close associate of Partha Chatterjee, both have been arrested by Enforcement Directorate in job scam. Uh, Arpita has two flats, uh, you know, uh, in this particular residence, uh, which is under uh, you know probe, and uh, we are given to understand that uh, today, when both will be interrogated yes. for an uh, for, a, for several hours. Stay on, stay on, stay on, right there. Priyanka, I want to bring in Priyanka Tibrewal of the Bharatiya Janata Party as well. You know, Priyanka, West Bengal is a very large state, and there are many ministers in uh, Mamata's cabinet as well. Uh, Leave alone Mamta resigning or not, what the BJP is demanding, that, uh, uh, that, that is something we are not getting into. But shouldn't Partha Chatterjee, one, be sacked, B, Mamta should come out clean with her relationship with Partha Chatterjee in terms of a professional relationship, what she shared, and come out and issue a clarification whether she knew, did not know, uh, etc. They do not have the audacity to do that. That is the reason they are now not asking him to resign. Because you see, there is a kahavat in Hindi, chor chor mosere bhai. And from, uh, you know, top to bottom, all of them are involved. I am telling you that this 40 crore is nothing. It's just peanuts. If uh, all the ministers of this uh, incumbent, if of this sitting government, you know, if they are investigated, then you will find out that the figure will cross 4,000 crores. Because top to bottom, all of them, all of them are involved in this. That's the reason they are not raising any or taking any actions. Now, see, this is the same government who was very, very uh, aggressive in saying, you know, that the Goa chief minister should resign. Why, why were they asking him to resign when here all your tainted ministers now and I call them tainted because half of them are jail returns like Bobby Hakim, like Kunal Ghosh. They have all gone to the jail and now also investigation is in process. But they are still the sitting ministries and holding portfolios. So when she doesn't question them when she, uh, and, and, and there, thereafter she says that, you know, she's a, a very honest uh, chief minister. This is the honesty which is being uh, shown on the TV screens now. So her no, taking no action in itself speaks that they are all involved in this. You see, they always question that uh, ED is being used. Now, I will tell you certain figures from 2014 till 2021, after coming of the NDA government, that is the BJP government, there is zero tolerance to corruption. How many no, no, Priyanka, this is not a debate about uh, the BJP. Made? This is, of course, about TMC. And you have very valid points right there as far as West Bengal is concerned, as far as Mamta Banerjee is concerned. And right questions being asked on Mamta Banerjee's silence. We leave it at that. Thank you very much, Priyanka, for joining us and Ritik as well for bringing Thank us you. that ground report right there.